Alrighty, let's get started. First, you will need an embroidery hoop. You get those on Amazon for like $4, $5, and then you'll need a punch needle, which I bought for $11.99, which was the cheapest option in Amazon for the cloth. It's hard to get cloth on Amazon, but there are some. Um, you could use some towel-like cloth, or you could use the best cloth you, you could use is a 300 thread count, and either you could do a white one or a colorful, whichever you prefer. I preferred the black and white looking one because that's the cloth I had at home. How to use the embroidery hoop is to unscrew the top, get the inner circle, put it below the fabric, and then tighten the fabric on top of the smaller circle, and then put the outer circle on top. And then you just tighten the hoop up. And now you just have to figure out a design. Let's get to the punch needle itself. There this pack comes with three different sizes of needles. I use the biggest size. And then make sure to cover them up because they're pretty sharp. So th this is a lever to make um, the needle go deep or not deep. So the, these needles are um, detachable. It just has an arrow in it and there's a lock mechanism to it. So you just match the uh, edges to it and just lock it in. So you just put it back in and then decide what height you want. I use the longest height as possible, so it's just easier for the thread to stay in. It also comes with this um stringy thing that helps to just like um needle in through um the thread through the whole hair. So I'm gonna be um um putting in some diagrams for you to understand even more. So you would just put the string through the hoops and then just pull this um, hoop, long skinny hoop, right through like that. And then you would put the hoop through the hole which all the needles come through and then just thread the string once again in the hoop and then just pull the hoop through. This one of the tricky parts that I find it's good to have a bigger string. The bigger the needle, the bigger the yarn size or the thread you could use. The skinnier the needle, the skinnier thread you need. Alrighty. And then just pull through a little bit of a tail. And then just stab it through your <laughs> fabric. I haven't actually drawn out a design since I'm just doing it freehand just to help you. So once you first start, you just make the first hole and take the tail out. So it won't bother you when you do your design. So the way this works is, and the longer needle you have, the, the longer piece of string at the back you have. Do you see what this is like? So you just stab through and then the remaining string remains. So the longer needle you have, the better. It's also helpful if you just keep on pulling the hoops at the back and just hold them tightly since there isn't anything holding the string together. Also invest in some scissors, thread cutting scissors, they're very helpful. I use them for anything to be honest, they're very sharp. Alright, so I just took the tail of the ending of the design and just brought it back to make it look neater. See what I mean when you just pull the string and a whole design comes off? That's what happens. So you could and about the thread, I usually buy the ones that come in multi colors, so you could use as many. They look like yarn, but they're much skinnier. Find yarn or thread that fits your needles. All right, that is perfect. And if you mess up, you could just cut a part of it and just pull it out. That's perfect. And just go back, flip it around, and just pull it just to make the design tighter. These are some of the designs that I made. It does take a while to learn. It's difficult, but if you have it in mind, it'll work. And at the back, it'll be very messy, so you would have to find an adhesive just to pat it down. Or you could always find some fabric glue and glue another piece of fabric at the back. These are some mountains I made, which is the first thing I've ever made, which is kind of sloppy and messy, but hey, I'm still learning. This does take a lot of practice. Some people can't even figure it out. For me, it took a long time to figure out, but eventually it will. This is the most recent one I did. If you guys have any questions, just comment below.